I am not responsible if you get your ass kicked at McDonald's for trying to steal coke. Do it at your own discretion. What is up everybody? It's 9 o'clock in the morning now. Uh, we are headed to the Ross School of Business to attend a seminar on cultural differences in the classroom. And after that we are going to get some breakfast. Sunny for the bus now. We got up at the wrong bus stop because we weren't paying attention really. Now we've got to walk to the Ross School of Business. It's going to take us about 5-10 minutes but uh, I think we can make it in time. Up. So we've got a special guest in Michigan. We've got Himesh Shamia here. <laughs> He's pursuing his academic career here under a false name. Himesh, what do you have to say, bro? I, I don't know these people. It's just random people on the street I met. Celebrities, so, you know. Thanks. So right now we are heading to uh, what mall? Blairwood. Blairwood. Blairwood to pick up Himesh's Mac. So we are at Blairwood Mall. that I learned today is that American malls are not like the ones back home in India. So Pradeep here is going to explain to us what an American mall basically is. So uh, basically an American mall constitutes of a large area with multiple stores rather than what Indians believe is like one building with multiple stores. Yeah, they spread it out. Like basically an Indian mall just been pressed from above and just scattered across. So it's like you have to walk a lot more in an Indian mall but it also has like bigger shops. So instead of like a small shop and having multiple of them, it's like one huge shop and there's few of them. Yeah, so we're walking around the mall now and you can see like everything is around us. We've got like parking lots and stores and everything. Yeah, so that's basically what a mall is here. We've just finished attending a seminar on laws here and I'll be making a video about it very soon because some of them are really funny actually but yeah, so now it's 12 to 15 and we're heading on to have some lunch because we've got a seminar at 1 o'clock. Just done with lunch and uh, now I'm heading to the banking information seminar. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna learn a lot of useful stuff there, so I'll let you guys know what I learned there. Okay, before you see the next part of this video, I just want to say that a free meal is only free when it's free. Don't get onto a bus, pay four dollars, go to a place that apparently gives you a free meal that's worth only six dollars, and then get back onto the bus and again pay four dollars for the trip back home. That's not a free meal. You just paid eight dollars for a six dollar meal dipshit. So if you're looking out for your next free meal, here's a pro tip. The next time you get a notification on Facebook saying that there's a free meal anywhere in your vicinity, don't be happy, be alert. Because everyone on Facebook in that area has got that notification. And whether you like it or not, there are many students like you and me that are waiting for the next free opportunity. So you need to plan ahead and get there before everybody else does. All right, what is up? We've just found out that there's free pizza here. So we've all taken the bus from campus. And uh, yeah, it's free food, so basically, so we'll come anywhere for free food. It looks like there's a slight queue outside. We'll just shoot that for you. The line here is crazy. I guess a lot of people got the memo that there's going to be free pizza here. So it just extends and extends and extends. So yeah, we're probably going to go eat at a McDonald's or something like that. Because by the time we get in, it's going to be like 9 and the place closes at 9. Pizza! Everybody wants free pizza! Going to McDonald's! Yay! I just uh, had them fake that they're going to McDonald's. And for all the cheap people out there, how to get free Coke at McDonald's? So, the main thing you do is when you walk into a McDonald's store, they give you an option of either going for a meal or just a burger. What you do then is just ask for a burger and ask for a glass of water. So, the glass of water comes pretty much the same as the small a glass of Pepsi does. So, what you do is you finish the water, throw away the ice, go to one of the dispensers, fill in Coke and just walk away. No charge is And always, always remember one thing, whether it's free pizza, free burgers, free sandwiches, free chairs, free vessels, or even free flu shots. In the words of Edard, House of Stark, Lord of Winterfell, Lord Paramount, and Warden of the North, Indians are coming.
Jhat dikhla.